Well, I think, you know, not a day goes by without somebody mentioning the housing crisis in London. Um, the figures are staggering. We need to, we ought to be building 66,000 new homes a year. That's every year up to 2030. It's a staggering amount. But it's not just about housing, actually. As the city grows um, and expands, we also need to provide workplaces, shops, services, amenities to accommodate that growing population. So the competition for land around London is, is massive. It's huge. Um, we can't keep doing the same thing over and over again. It's clear that we now need to think a lot more creatively um, about how we're going to solve the, the housing crisis and provide the workplaces that we need. So one solution we're putting forward in our report, Better Brownfields, is to look at what we're calling big box sites around London. These are sites which are dominated by single storey, retail and industrial type sheds. So you see them all, all over the city and we think they're not the best use of space um, and we could actually redesign those sites to accommodate a mix of shops, services, employment space and housing. We've identified something in the region of 1200 sites across London and we've worked out that you could fit around a quarter of a million new homes on those sites alongside commercial uses. Um, we, we also just tried out one site, we redesigned it to see whether our ideas would work and we found that you can increase the, the density on those sites by quite a significant degree without uh, resorting to building huge towers, but by delivering a mix of um, terraced housing, mansion blocks and mid-rise blocks, as well as you know, the, the, the commercial uses that are there already. And that's because we, you know, we're making better use of the space around it. We're putting in uh, traditional streets, patterns that you see you know in, in 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 more traditional parts older parts of of the city and we're essentially re we're, we're using that sort of streetscape to um increase density around around the city so we think you know we're proposing this as a sort of more creative um and hopefully a more popular way of increasing density around the city so that we can provide for both both the, sh the, the services and commercial space and the homes that we need.